Hi, this is Carrie bright Blenchbaugh, and in this short video we're going to explore what content curation projects are. A common issue that teachers of writing in the disciplines often face is how to best explain and discuss the inside workings of writing in their scholarly fields. It is often difficult for experienced writers to step back and look with fresh eyes at what we do when we write and why we do it. As members of our academic communities, we are so emerged and engaged in the language and ways of thinking of the field that they become common every day, automatic to us as insiders. So our writing program has started exploring how we can better support faculty efforts to talk about writing in their discipline to outsiders of their discipline. We've turned to content curation projects as an avenue to support faculty in their process of examining important and relevant, relevant types of writing in their discipline and the thinking processes that go on behind them. In other words, content curation projects aim to make what was once unexplained or kept private accessible to those attempting to be a part of a discipline or simply understand writing in that discipline. As the culminating product of our annual Writing Across the Curriculum Academy, we have found that content curation projects are not only an engaging and empowering process for WAC Academy participants, but the products are also valuable resources for other writing instructors and student writers. These projects seek to explore three guiding questions. Number one, what are significant genres in your discipline? Number two, how do these genres and their components function rhetorically and socially? Number three, what do they why do they function in that way? Content curation projects engage the language of museums to help us think metaphorically about the structures and shapes of writing in the disciplines. The subsequent curation product includes types of writing, or what we refer to as genres, along with the disciplinary values that these genres represent. Therefore, the curation of a genre usually includes elements such as the common rhetorical moves within a piece of writing, the dominant disciplinary discourses and styles of writing, and implied values that are embedded in the writing itself. These projects strive to present such information in a visually engaging and at times interactive manner that can help others gain new perspectives about such writing. So let's think through this curation metaphor. A curator's work to create a museum exhibit includes steps like identifying a theme, selecting significant artifacts to include in the exhibit, contextualizing the selected piece and the theme, arranging and organizing the artifacts in a meaningful way, and curating the exhibit's artifacts individually and in relation to the overall theme. Similarly, in the process of creating content curation projects, the writer instructors identify significant types of writing, contextualize these genres for, specific audience, for a specific audience, consider how the genres work individually and as a whole related to the, the discipline, organize and present them in a meaningful and engaging manner, and curate the types of writing individually and all together as a complete digital exhibit. For more information on how content curation projects are created and how they contribute to writer instru writer, writing instructor professional development and our greater learning community, please check out how and why is a content curation projects video that is accessible on ECU's writing program website.